So um, when you're like when you're trying to you know make music or trying to get work within the music industry, do you ever get any sort of depressional states and stuff like that? Um, can it, do you ever get any demotivating times? Yes, absolutely, for sure. Um, <clears throat> so I remember the the good times as well. Yeah. So I remember winning a competition of this very prominent house producer called Joey Negro. Yeah, I know him. And, um, yeah, yeah. And I, I did a remix for him and I won this competition. It was run by Future Music Magazine. Mm. And they sent me like, I, I was like £3,000 worth of studio equipment. And I, I, I just remember being feeling so high and I thought my phone's going to be ringing every day. I'm going to get all this work. And then it doesn't work like that. You know, yeah. you still you don't just have one great thing happen and then it's all gravy. You still got to keep working. Um, and the, yeah, the disappointing times, um, mostly is like not winning remix competitions or sending tunes to labels and having them, uh, denied. But, you know, over time you just learn that that's rejection isn't a bad thing. It's an opportunity to learn. Yeah. And if people are good enough to give you some feedback on why your music shit, mm. <laughs> sorry, if I can <laughs> no, say that. No, that's that, all right. <laughs> <laughs> then, then that's when you, you, you have a word with your ego Yeah. and then you say, okay, right, I'll take that on board and then you can make improvements. So, um, I, I think the depression mostly has come in the past from slogging away, working really hard and having nothing to show for it mm. um, and sitting on your own, you know, in some crappy bed sit in a bad part of town with no money, you're cold, you can barely afford to eat and you're on your own in your city at a computer making music. That's that's the depressing times. <laughs> <laughs> I get that. Um, what, so what would you, what would you do to get, a, get through those depressing moments? Do you, did you have any thing you did or did you just slog at it and keep slogging away? Um, various things gave up, Ooh. get a job doing something I didn't like doing, hmm. realize that I can't possibly do that because that's no life to live. So then take it up again, hmm. try keep trying um yeah it's you know i've i've stopped once or twice for a period of months or maybe a year or so and then it and then i just have to it just draws me back you know yeah. and i think that's the, the case for anyone who really tries to give up something that they love they'll they'll be drawn back to it um despite the difficulties and that's really what matters is whether you can get back on the horse in the sky gazing far into the night I raise my hand